When you live on campus at UCF, you get the full university experience. This video provides an overview of what to expect when you live on campus, the types of housing available, how to apply for housing, and where to learn more. Hi, I'm Hayden. I'm the marketing coordinator with UCF Housing. To get started, we like to share a little bit about why we think it's important to live on campus for at least your first year at UCF. Living on campus puts you closer to classes and food, 24-hour staff support, and tons of great campus activities. Students who get involved on campus are more likely to enjoy their college experience and get the most out of their time at UCF. They are also more likely to be successful academically and to graduate on time. One of the best parts of living on campus is who you meet. This is where you'll make lifelong friends and memories. When living on campus, students can expect an environment that provides support and convenience while being focused on safety and learning. All UCF housing comes furnished and includes high-speed wireless internet, all utilities with no caps, study lounges, laundry facilities, on-call maintenance, 24-hour residence life staff, and some communities even get housekeeping services. All housing communities allow for basic cooking. Residents in rooms without kitchens can bring their own mini fridges, microwaves, and coffee pots. Residents in apartments with kitchens can bring most cooking appliances, like toaster ovens and the like, as long as they stay in the kitchen. All the guidelines can be found online. Residents also have the opportunity to buy a meal plan. UCFdining.com has great information on all the meal plan options, which can be used at our two on-campus dining halls and even at some campus restaurants. We do encourage our residents to learn a bit about cooking and fire safety before arriving on campus. Even microwave food can burn badly if cooked improperly. That brings us to our campus safety features. All housing communities have 24-hour staff, security cameras, blue light security phones, electronic keys and locks, and we have a great connection with the university police. UCF PD are amazing people who are here to help keep us safe, but also to be a resource. They provide services to residents like Operation ID, a program where they will engrave your ID numbers on important items. They provide bike registration, as well as operating the night ride service, a nighttime safety escort to help you get around campus during late hours. For services they provide, visit their website. The last thing all of our housing communities have in common is a focus on learning, which means residents at UCF get much more than just a roof over their head. All of our on-campus residents get the benefit of learning important life skills and building social connections. Our staff help them with that through a residential curriculum. This is a learning plan that our staff use to help residents learn three key concepts while they live with us. Community engagement, self-awareness, and equity and inclusion. The curriculum is interwoven into all of the things we do in housing, from bulletin boards and flyers, to community meetings, fun events, video updates, and even one-on-one -on -one conversations with their resident assistant. We use all of these different strategies to help our students learn more about themselves, about interacting with those around them, and about being equitable and inclusive of those in their communities. Now let's go over our five housing agreement options. The first option is our most popular type of housing, academic year. Academic year housing is located on the main campus and includes only the fall and spring semesters. Students in academic year housing go home over the winter break and live in the Apollo, Libra, Nike, Hercules, Neptune, and Lake Clair communities. Most academic year rooms are traditional suite style shared rooms. That means two people share one bedroom and usually two bedrooms share one bathroom. Academic year housing has a limited number of private rooms. The only way to ensure you get a private room on campus is to choose one of our annual housing agreements, like the Towers or Northview. Our second housing agreement type is the Towers. The Towers are annual housing. That means they include the fall, spring, and following summer semesters and are open during all breaks between semesters, including the winter break. In the Towers, each student has a private bedroom with a full-sized bed, and in most units, two students share a bathroom. Towers apartments are four bedrooms and include a full kitchen and living room. The third housing option is Northview. Northview is annual as well, and all residents at Northview have a private bedroom and a private bathroom. These apartments all include granite countertops, gourmet kitchens, and a washer and dryer inside every apartment. Northview also includes several amenities like a game room, fitness center, pool, sand volleyball, and more. 
The next two housing types are located at different campuses. Option four is the Rosen College Apartments at the Rosen College of Hospitality Management. This is located about 40 minutes from the main campus and is designed specifically for hospitality and event management majors. The Rosen Agreement includes fall and spring semesters only, but stays open during winter break, and residents have the option to add the summer semester if they choose to do so. Rosen Apartments feature private bedrooms for all residents, and most are four-bedroom, two-bathroom units with large kitchens and living rooms. Rosen also happens to be the only housing community with a heated pool. Option 5 is located at the new UCF Downtown Campus and is our newest housing, Union West. Like the towers in Northview, Union West is an annual housing agreement for fall, spring, and the following summer semesters and remains open during breaks. Union West offers both private and shared rooms in a combination of suite style and apartment style housing units. To recap, UCF has five standard housing agreement types, each starting in the fall and lasting either two or three semesters. If you're starting at UCF as a freshman during the summer, we call that Summer B. It's only about six weeks long and is a separate housing agreement. The majority of our Summer B freshmen will live in the Nike, Hercules, and Neptune communities during this six-week semester. UCF has another great opportunity to take that big college experience and make it more focused through living learning communities. Some of these include nursing at Nike, honors, lead scholars, future educators, and more. A living learning community, or LLC, is a group of students living together in one area who share a common interest or academic experience. To learn more about our living learning communities or any of our other housing options, we suggest checking out our website. It contains a wealth of information about all of our housing communities and options. If you're ready to apply for housing, you'll want to go online. Our website has application instructions under the apply menu. You'll want to submit your application and prepayment online. From there, we will send you an email when your application status is changed to confirmed. A confirmed housing status means you have a guaranteed space. You can also use the housing portal to search for potential roommates, form a roommate group, and submit an application for a living learning community if you would like. Once you are confirmed for housing, keep an eye on your email. Further instructions on participating in online room selection will come later in the year. Keep in mind these tips for success. Apply for housing as soon as you are offered admission to UCF. The housing agreement opens in October for the following summer and fall. Plan now for the housing prepayment, enrollment deposits, and orientation fees. Stay on top of your financial aid. Sign up for Knight's email and use it after you are admitted. Remember, space is limited. Notify us in a timely fashion if you will not need on-campus housing. It's just an email for you, but that allows another student to be sure they have a space on campus. To take a virtual housing tour, you can view the video tours on our website, or you can view a 360 virtual tour on our YouTube channel. Finally, if you have any questions, reach out to us. Real Humans answer our phones and our emails Monday through Friday during business hours. Thanks for watching. Go Knights, charge on.